Hey, I'm kind of getting caught up on the vlogs here. I'm going to start to pick up the consistency, as I've mentioned. I'm having a lot of fun with it. A couple favors I'd like to ask you. Uh, one, like, what do you guys want to see more? Like, what do you like? What do you enjoy? I, I did um, something here in the community tab. So there's a little uh, survey here. So tell me the things you like to see most, the kinds of content. Um, you can only select one, which is unfortunate, but drop some comments below here too. Just tell me what you like to see. That's the first thing. I appreciate the feedback. I, I want to make this entertaining for you. Um, the next thing on each video, if you could do me a big favor, one, if you could subscribe, okay? That means you actually have to sign up for a Google account, which is fine. I mean, as I said, Google's gonna take over the world eventually, so you might as well succumb now. Once you kind of log into Google, um, you, should, you should hit a subscribe button that will be right here um, next to my name, number one. And number two, if you enjoy the video, click this little thumbs up. Again, the amount of subscriptions, thumbs up, and interactions in the comments below, that's how Google algorithm uh, judges the the effectiveness of the video so um if you love it let me know if you hate it let me know but either way subscribe thumbs up thanks uh let's jump in doing denver for family reunion my grandma's 90th and the boys this could go either way so proud of their Lightning McQueen suitcase. I gotta tell everyone about it. You missed the video, which was a good one, because I was just running through the airport to our gate, pushing three-year-old twins in the double stroller with a backpack and a huge purse. <laughs> like I remember run before. <laughs> that was the slowest security line ever. We shouldn't leave like only an hour at the airport. No, Todd, this is not just Todd traveling on his own, thinking he can just run right to the to the gate and be fine. So she gets to me and she's like, get me water. And like, the gates are closing. So I'm like, oh my God, what do I do? So he stole a bottle of water. <laughs> stole a bottle of water from the airport. To. I didn't mean to. I'll pay you back, I promise. You're crazy. That is so sweet. Oh. That's his whoopee. That's his most precious thing in the world. And he gave it to the little girl he just met, McKenna, who's also three. Trish did a great job. Packed a whole bunch of brand new toys for the kids and like, good job. Thanks. My laptop was on the stroller. That's underneath the plane. Oops. Which had a bunch of movies that the boys were supposed to watch. going to my grandmother's 90th birthday and all my family lives in Littleton and Colorado go grandma so it's gonna be a lot of fun take the boys up do some Colorado things have a good time Listen, if he's gonna pull the famous at the end of the flight let me just fall asleep real quick just in time to get off the plane yeah. it never fails every time like we're landing Check this out, we have like 10 minutes to go. That's about right. Good news, laptop made it <laughs> under the stroller, which was underneath the plane. Which was folded in half. Which was folded in half. Laptop looks pretty good. Car situation. Originally we are going to come out Friday. I forgot to change the reservation to Wednesday, which is today. From there, I guess they had a huge hailstorm in Denver two weeks ago. Took out the whole fleet of rental cars. We couldn't find one. I was almost... Welcome to Marathon. May I help you? Yes. Then you can give me a fucking automobile. They sit down. You're okay. gonna fall. Yes, sir. Okay. Where's your singing? I 
thought the Rocky Mountains would be a little rockier than this. That John Denver's full of shit, man. They're not shy at all. Good morning. We're driving Route 70 out of Denver, heading up into the mountains. Uh, we're heading to whitewater rafting. Eisenhower Tunnel, 1973. Can you believe it? There's a mountain up there. I don't know if you guys have seen in prior videos, but pretty much the coolest things in life to Jake and Brody are Trish. Elevators and tunnels. Escalators. Escalators. Car washes. Car washes. Like, I think it is so gorgeous out here. Trish, what do you think? I do too. It's very pretty. Can we get a summer home or a winter home and a summer home here? Okay. And a fall home and a spring home? Here, Saratoga, wherever you want. Okay. Our brakes are okay, boys. We don't have to go up. She's so nervous. She's a Jersey girl. She's not used to this. I am slowly becoming Clark W. Griswold. We drove all the way up here. As soon as we pull in the parking lot, they're like, oh, the river has come up too much for the kids. We can't take them. I was like, oh. So I was like, guys, you know you have kids coming in from Denver driving up. Like, you got to be on top of that calling us. And they're like, they apologize profusely. So I'm kind of like Clark W. Griswold driving all the way to the Wally World. And they're like, sorry, folks, park's closed. So now we're gonna go find um, a river where the kids can throw. Do you guys want to throw rocks? Okay. Yes. Okay, That's let's the go. only thing to do. There's no rail there. All right, I'm gonna drive. Oh, okay. Is that awesome or what? How pretty is that? Great. Let's huh? Go. Come on, let's get moving. I said no because Mommy, I my stop kids it. don't. Let's go. Oh, are we all happy? <laughs> Dude, all you can do is just laugh at times like this. <laughs> so, we're making the best of a Wally World situation. And the guide, after I told him, like, dude, he's like, all right, here's a cool spot where you guys can go and hang out. So we're going to go. Um, the boys love skipping rocks in the river. We did that for the first time a couple weeks ago in New Jersey. So now here we are in Colorado, in the Colorado River, and we're going to skip rocks. I think we're going to take a potentially bummer of a situation and make it fun. <laughs> High five, buddy.
stopping off in Breckenridge. Uh, I want to check out Breck Brewery and also Breck Distillery. Really, they're doing really well. So wait, I can't find him. Where is he? Oh, there he is. <laughs>